my science experiment requires making kind of a mess and my parents didn't want me to do it in their yard. So, for those of you who don't know, my science experiment is the Coke and Mentos reaction. Where, when you combine these Mentos with Diet Pepsi or Coke, it'll create a violent reaction. So, for my science experiment, I decided to test the differences between using that kind of soda and using these many different kinds. I'm also going to see if using salt does anything to see if the sodium in the Mentos is what makes it react. For this science experiment, I'm going to be use, using the Diet Coke and the Mentos as the control because we know that that is the one thing that will, will for surely work. The other thing that I have is using salt and Diet Pepsi. Using Diet Pepsi Max, which has a large amount of caffeine in it to see if caffeine is, uh, makes a difference. Diet Mountain Dew, which is basically Diet Pepsi but different flavor. BK Sparkling Water, which is to see if just the uh, carbonation has anything to do with it. And Normal Pepsi to see if the diet part of it has anything to do with it. For the first part of my experiment, I'm going to be doing the control so you can all see what it's supposed to look like. Here I have the normal Diet Pepsi and the Mentos. So what I'm going to do is, at step one, I am going to open the Diet Pepsi to remove all the carbonation. So hold on while I do that. Now that I've got the Pepsi open, I'm going to open the Mentos to pour out Now what I'm going to do is just simply put these four Mentos inside the Diet Pepsi and watch the reaction. Now hold on. There I have the Mentos. And there is the Diet Pepsi. There I go. I will again be using Diet Pepsi because it is the control and the change in this um, trial will be using salt instead of Mentos to see if the sodium in the Mentos is what makes it rough. So hold on for a second while I release the carbonation and open up the cap. I have never done this in salt before so this is going to be the first time for me. So I'm not sure how it's going to react or anything. So here I go. What I'm going to do is I just opened up this big pack of salt. I'm going to put it to the Coke. I don't know how it's going to react, so I'm going to get ready to jump back. Here we go. As you can see, salt had a huge impact on it, but not as big as the Mentos for some reason. I just poured in another helping of salt, and it still uh, erupted because it still had carbonation. I'm going to do it yet again, just to see. Yep, as long as it has carbonation, it'll still make the eruption with the salt. Okay. Right now, I'm going to try the experiment as my third trial with Diet Pepsi Max. Because Diet Pepsi Max is just Diet Pepsi except it has a huge amount of caffeine. Once again, I'm doing this experiment with the Diet Pepsi Max to see if the caffeine has anything to do with it. So now, I just release the cap. I let all the carbonation come out. Well, not all of it, but all, the, all of it that was trapped in the air. And I have the Mentos and I'm ready to do the experiment. Okay, here I go. Whoa! As you can see from that, I used four Mentos like I did before, but this time it had a much larger reaction, therefore proving 
that caffeine in the Diet Pepsi Max and whatever else is in here that's separate has a different reaction and makes it even bigger. Now for my fourth trial, I will do the same thing except with Diet Mountain Dew to see if that has any, any difference. Now we know that the difference between Diet Pepsi and Diet Mountain Dew is the flavor of soda. This is lemon soda while the other one is cold. So hold on while I on caffeine. Now that I've uncapped the Diet Mountain Dew and I have the four Mentos, I'm going to put them in and see what happens. up all these sodas that are on the ground, I had realized one big thing that kind of contributes to this experiment. All of the Mentos that I put into the uh, sodas, the bodies were still there without the shells. So that can also prove that it isn't what's inside the Mentos that makes it react, but it's what's on the outside. <laughs> 